Hello and привет! This is Sergey. Welcome back to Let Us Be Playing Chrono Trigger. Uh, first, I must apologize for uh, the long wait between last video and present. It it has been over a fortnight, and I know that perhaps you have become impatient, but there was a small misunderstanding between me and roommates where I tried to pay rent in rubles and I had to explain to him how sometimes rubles can look like box top of, of cereal cookie crisp and he did not understand the intricacies of Russian system of currency but that is all over now and, and we are back to playing game and I am sorry for an absence of many winters but well while I was a uh, preoccupied uh, I, I took advantage of this time to level up uh, some characters so that they will be more powerful for the challenge ahead and you know I have already defeated these these villains so I will not bother too much with them yes it will just take a few regular attack in the a gun but that is a shine it is a showing of disrespect to him to hit with part of guns like they were not even enough to to use a bullet that's that is how much you suck here we will dodge the tevias because they are too busy doing a dance about tradition and, and marrying their daughters to to butchers and stuff or whatever they do their their culture is strange and incomprehensible to me so i will not try to decipher it here we will dodge the enemies with our sneaky skills that have won us many medals at Olympics. And here we come to Sparkle Node, where we can use uh, the shelter to restore every point. You see that shelter is a powerful device which, which has newly been introduced to Russia. Before we would just sleep under the snow and that worked for us but now there is shelter and so we do not need to do that okay this door i sense much foreboding coming from within its confines so i will i will enter carefully and immediately i am greeted by music of challenge i run to face it in the head and I see we find Chancellor, which is confusing because I thought he was back at castle, but I don't know, perhaps he is old, perhaps he thought this was drugstore for him to come and get like his Viagras or something. I, I do not know how old people think, but I know that sometimes they go to get prescription drugs, so that, that perhaps is it. Or he could get covered in electricity and turned into a floppy ox made out of tapioca pudding. Yes, that is what I suspected would happen all along. He rewards... Excuse me, rewards to Rasputin. Yes, it turns out the Chancellor was really Rasputin in disguise. Now, allow me to give you a brief history lesson about Rasputin. He was, uh, he was the Chancellor to the Tsar and uh, oftentimes the Tsar would like invite him to to a swanky dinner party and, and Rasputin would sit there and be all swanky and then all of a sudden he would say he, he would he would like be eating all of his food in a weird way and he would look around and, and he would say Drew yes that is that is what he would say and it was so awkward for everyone because you know when when the floppy ox made of tapioca appears you know and says drew how do you react to this there is no answer so a bunch of nobles from the Tsar's court decided to dispose of rasputin and for they did not like his saying of drew so they created a, a conspiracy to kill him and they tried many things they would try uh, they would try to poison they try they try a shoot a club a stab they try to drown they try to freeze him in a river 
They try to run him over with a truck. They feed him to a giant bird. Drop out of hot air balloon. They put him in the chasm for a while. They threw a bunch of dodgeballs at him. They kicked him in the groin repeatedly. Okay, at this point they had stopped trying to kill him and were just kind of goofing off. But I digress. The point is that no one has ever found out what could be used to kill Rasputin, so... I am sort of worried about how he will win this battle if there is no way that he can be killed. Understandably, so... I don't... Uh... Oh. Uh... Okay, we killed him. Well, that's, that is a surprise. I guess, with help of Dr. Zhivago, in combination technique of communism unite for swords, we can achieve the impossible. That is, that is lesson for today. So, there you go. All right, Princess is grateful. Dr. Z says that, that he will return to castle and thanks us for our help. That is, that is great. Okay, but now I'm interested in discovering what will be hidden in treasure chest. So here we get mid ether. This is a more powerful version of hallucinogenic drug of ether, which we have already encountered. It was, it was a favorite of Hunter S. Thompson. So, what will reside in second treasure chest? I can hardly contain excite. It, it is an old man tied up with ropes. That. It is a pretty crappy treasure, I will not lie. This will not aid us in battle at all. He, he just kind of... walks around and, and has wavy hair. These are not useful skills for fighting. But at least we have saved the queen. Yes, the Rasputin. This is historic moment for Russia because now we witness genesis of Gulag system of justice. This will serve us well in many years to come. But, oh, there is not everything well for it. Dr. Zhivago feels like he has disgraced royal family. And now he must leave for... to lend himself into exile. We will try to stop him, but his spirit is too proud. And he will not... He will not listen to our words. This, this is sad. But what can we do? Look at how happily and majestically he hops away. Even Sasha, whose heart is colder than freezing Siberian tundra, has admitted that Froggy was not such bad guy. This is how you know he was truly great man. I see the queen is still appreciative for us saving. Oh crap, I have forgotten. We must save the Princess Anastasia, who was turned into a sparkly lads. But I am loath to do this task, so I will put off until next episode. For we have done much today and have earned many rests. So until next time, remember to subscribe, do comment, uh, perhaps send me ruples over PayPal so that you do not, I do not get kicked out of house again, and. Uh, and I will see you in next video. Farewell. Bloop.